Hello, it's Jason Coaches. I'm back with another inking video. This time I'm going to be inking a drawing of Ranmo and Shampoo from Ranmo One Half by uh, Rumiko Takahashi. I'm not exactly sure if this drawing is or was created by Rumiko Takahashi or not. Um, it certainly looks like her style, but there are definitely elements that I don't think are her. I'm not sure. If, if you happen to know who created this, please let me know in the comments below. And also, if you haven't already, please like and subscribe. I'll really appreciate it. I also have a Patreon, which is listed below the video. Um, you can always check that out for more content uh, like this. I would appreciate it. So yeah, I, I typically uh, start with the eyes and I was thinking about it. Why do I always start with that? And it's usually because you know, I've just gotten the brush dipped into the ink, so I feel like I'm going to make the cleanest, um, most precise marks. So I always try to start with the eyes when I'm doing the figure. But here you can see I'm, I'm rotating the paper around, uh, trying to get the best angle, and also not get my hand um, into the areas that I've already inked. And just there I was reaching across the, the drawing, but I was successful at it. Um, this hand actually makes me think that it is not a Rumiko Takahashi drawing. Something about the the gesture and the way that the the middle finger there is kind of twisted back. But um, again, this looks like it's a, a rough sketch, rough rough layout. So so it could in fact be her. I'm just not 100 percent sure. Definitely familiar with these characters. Uh, definitely uh, one of the animes that I got into very early in college. You know, I grew up uh, watching Robotech when I was younger, like in third grade. Um, so I'd always, and you know, I, I liked uh, Voltron and Transformers, and I feel like all those shows had a um, definitely a very early anime. And so, you know, I just sort of for one reason or other, I was at the video store and I saw a Ranma one half uh, cassette cover and just picked it out and took it home, watched it, and was instantly into it. Again, starting with the eyes, um, this pose of shampoo is really very, very cute. Um, definitely could be uh, originally by Rumiko Takahashi. I don't remember this scene in any of the the manga or anything like that, so definitely really fun fun pose, really good interaction. Definitely sums up uh Ranma's uh I feel like his feelings towards shampoo. Her costume, I wasn't really exactly sure uh, what was going on here, so I just sort of did kind of what I thought was supposed to be happening. And uh, I'm going to fill her hair in with black, so I'm not being too careful with some of the lines uh, up against that area. And just putting a little bit of a, a white line in the in their pants because both of their pants are going to be black. I uh, just want to be able to see where the leg is. This, the little bit of hair here at the end, that really makes me think that it's not a Rumiko Takahashi sketch. But whoever did it, um, I, I like it a lot. And um, it is certainly passable as, um, as the characters. Gonna go ahead and fill in uh, Ranma's hair here. And um, I had a little trouble with the fingers, trying to match the fingers near his ear to the fingers that I thought were on his, that arm, his right arm there. Um, so I'm probably gonna have to go back in with a little bit of white ink to clean those areas up. The 
this drawing is definitely accelerated. I think it took me about 45 minutes total to ink this in. I'll probably uh, speed up the video a little bit quicker once I get um, the bigger areas to fill in with the black India ink. And you know, as I've been doing with most of this uh, series here, I, I print out the drawing in a light blue ink and then go over top of it with the black India ink. Again, um, I'm moving around the drawing, trying not to get my hand into the areas that I've already inked, which is uh, definitely was a struggle on this on this drawing. And if you haven't watched any of the other videos, I'm I'm doing this series to practice inking, get better with the brush, because I'm going to ultimately make my own. Um, manga-inspired uh, comic book. Here we go. I've got the white ink on the brush now, and so I'm trying to make those fingers match a little bit the fingers that are on on the right hand there. And I didn't... I, I felt like I went a little bit too far with the black ink on Ronma's pigtail, so I'm trying to clean that up as well. And I'm going to go back in with the Tombow brush and try to sharpen some of the areas that I felt where the brush just didn't do what I wanted it to do. And in a minute here, I will show you the side by side. Yeah, so on the left is the original sketch and on the right is my inked version. Uh, if you happen to like it and you want to see more, please like and subscribe to this YouTube channel and consider supporting me on Patreon. Thanks. See you next time.